What's going on everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Xenoblade 3 Future Redeemed. Last episode we had a bit of a heart to heart between Nicole and Matthew and we also got to see the return of Shulk who encountered Glimmer while she was off gallivanting. Um, and now we are, oh hello, we are starting an incursion apparently, here we go. Um, yeah, we are pursuing Glimmer and so we will make our way to the northwest to try and see if we can find her out there somewhere. And as you guys can tell, I'm actually talking pretty quietly. Hopefully the mic's picking me up okay, but uh, yeah, that's the uh, life of a dad. I've got a son who's actually right next door to me, and I'm trying my best not to wake him up. Um, <laughs> so we'll see how that goes. Yeah, unfortunately, I don't have the luxury of uh, having a finished basement where I can record without uh, disturbing my children. Oh, we destroyed him. And that is that territory captured. All right, that was a good warm up. Good warm up to start with, guys. Okay, let's go ahead and check out this cutscene right here. No idea what she just said, but okay. Uh, A, you're totally sure we're going the right way. The region beyond here is under Agnian control. If we posit she wanted to rejoin her people, there's a high chance she passed through here. All right, I trust you. <laughs> oh, what's up? Signs of battle. Not a full-scale army engagement. Something smaller. Huh. There's a reading, but it's faint. Which means refugees from the city. Perhaps. That or the girl could have been the source. Huh. Here. Oh, that's what we saw Definitely got cut has. off. Yeah. So she really was here. No husk, though. It likely means she was taken. You think maybe she killed them all? Unlike the soldier kids. We don't leave a trace after we kick the bucket. That's not possible. Given the evidence, they had the numerical advantage. Right, okay. So we follow them. If it is survivors from the city, they might know something about Nael. Indeed. What happened with Nael? I'm curious too. Oh, now I'm uh, now I'm curious. We're all curious over here, guys. Can't believe our luck. What are the chances of us finding city survivors out here? Pretty slim, guys. That's just one of the possibilities. Pretty sure 12 out of 10 times you're never gonna find city survivors out here. There we go. Oh, we've attracted an entire army. Wonderful. You'll love to see it. Good thing we're like four levels above all these guys. Oh, what is this? They've got like... Got like eggs. What the heck? Aspar egg. Can I, here, can I just attract one? Oh, shoot. <laughs> He's locked onto me, but he can't. Oh! Oh my gosh! What's going on? I just wanted to fight the unique monsters, but kind of hard when you got three eggs surrounding it. Let's see if I can be sneaky sneaky. And lure the elite or the uh, unique. Yeah, I think he's no, I think he's an elite. His elite just means that they're a normal monster, but a little harder. Destroy him. <laughs> oh, I wish that had an area of effect. I don't think it does, though. Oh, maybe it did. Oh, my. <gasps> They're all dead. That was sick. Oh, I'm gonna have to remember that one, guys. Sky <laughs> 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 
<laughs> Feeling full of beans, is that what he says? It's like Mickey Mouse Clubhouse over here. We're full of beans. Probably have no idea what I'm talking about unless you have little kids. Pant pant. Yeah. Still haven't caught up to Where the hell is she going? Well, we'll find out. Let's check it out. It looks like he's lagging behind. Hey, high time for a break. He's like, <gasps> thanks. <gasps> Got it. That's what the pan pant was about. Hey. Interact, it's probably going to make us do a little uh, huddle. Time for prep. Level up. Can I level up? I don't even know. I probably have. Oh, I can. We're level 21. We're going to be way higher than the enemies in this area. Maybe I over grinded. Off record. Craft gems. Can I? I might have collected enough stuff. I'm going to do this real quick. Okay, I think we are ready. Let's go ahead and interact. I hope there's enough time for prep. And progress the main story with resting. <sighs> I feel kind of guilty for freeing you from the cycle like that. It's fine. No, but I just can't stand to see it. You guys fighting all the time. <sighs> You're not really great with strangers, are you, pal? Mm. Do you wish you could go back to your colony? If I did, I'd have to fight again. <laughs> We're in the same boat. That's so. Well then, I guess that makes us friends, eh? Friends? I wonder how she is. Oh, he cares about her. <laughs> Release her. Huh? But teacher... She's already been freed from the flame clock. And that makes her a friend. Friend? All right, then. I'd like you to answer a few questions for me. May I? First, we'll need your name and the colony you belonged to. Colony Gamma or Colony 5? I think were the two that I saw. So your name is Glimmer. Glimmer. Colony Gamma. Yep, Gamma, okay. Assigned to the field support platoon, yes? Uh, Stop reading my far. things Gamma's that I publicly display. Here. So what are you doing out here all alone? Tell me who destroyed it. <laughs> Your colony's clock, I mean. That isn't military intel. Surely you could tell me that, no? Weirdos. Two of them. <laughs> Weirdos. Weirdos, indeed. They waded straight into our battle with Kevis. And then... And the consuls? <sighs> You're saying they took out Mobius. That's not too shabby. Teacher's level. What were these two like? One had silver hair, blue garb, cut the clock clean through with a red sword. Right. Mm. And the other? She looks like red Some sword, guy okay. didn't seem too bright. <laughs> Black clothes, used knuckles. He's the one that defeated the consoles with the power of some weird light. Hang on a sec. You're serious about that? That guy? Did his hair kind of look a bit like this? <laughs> you mean a ponytail? <laughs> it's Matthew. Has to be him. That's mad. So he's still alive. Matthew, eh? Ah, oh, yes. He's a guy from the city. We were in procurement together. If someone's been beating up Mobius, I can't think of anyone else but him. He's that strong, is he? Huh? You people, you're from the city? Quiet. 
Did I say you could ask questions? Hey, don't be so rude. We're friends, remember? No, it's all right. You're correct. We do have citizens among us. But there's a bit more to it. We are the Liberators. We seek out survivors from the city. Hey, that's what we're doing. Survivors? Well, seeking that's survivors. Right. I don't know if they're necessarily from the city, but I think that's what we were doing. Oh. Mobius trying to contact her or something? Hmm? Com signals. Who'd call at this time? Oh, one of them. Colony Eta approaching. He's here. That's that can't be good. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hang on now. Oh, wait, what? Liberator Sentry. I gotta fight these guys now? I better be able to take these guys out, unlike last time. I was completely set up to fail. Double attack power. Ugh. Starting to look like a triple attack power. <laughs> Except right as I say that, it disappeared. <laughs> Took him out relatively easily. <laughs> Look at the way he was sleeping. Did you guys see that? He was like sprawled out. Earthquake? No. Wrong. There's some kind of giant entity on the move. Over there. Whoa, that is a huge Faranis. Oh, Faranis! This late at night? Which colony is it? It's odd. It should have a crew of soldiers, but doesn't. It looks like it's heading to the east. After it, Matthew. Yeah! Is Shulk with the Monado? We've been had, teacher. Huh? The girl, she snuck off. You're kidding. The watch? Nope. She, she uh... knocked them clean out. <laughs> Nothing that'll leave a scar. Indeed. Yeah, she's good at that. Let's find She her. likes to gallivant. She'll likely be heading for a colony. They'll erase her on sight. Damn it, more babysitting. Told you we should have given her the full lowdown. I'm sorry. I thought it'd be too much for her to take in. I was hoping to ease her into it. <sighs> uh, teacher! Well now, this isn't good. Panacea, rouse the others now. Ready for battle! On it! Wow. Oh my goodness, so is she calling it to her? Like, she's... giving it uh, signal directions of some sort? Detect her by Made. GPS? Made it to what? A new Faramus with a new flame clock? Oh, that's bright. <laughs> I'm blind! I... I'm Glimmer from Colony Gamma. I was a member of the field support platoon. I lost my colony in the fight with Colony 5. I've been reconnoitering solo. Reconnoitering? Beyond here, the five dollar word for you. Oh, well, that's just what she needed. Some more light. I, I'm telling you, I'm Glimmer from Gamma. And uh, they don't seem to be friendly. I'm not your enemy. You're not, uh... Listen to me! Oh, but you are, <gasps> pet. Huh? Soldiers who've lost their, their flame 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 about with their purpose. Oh, no. My Lord Consul! You want to know why? Because you're no longer good for anything. Oh, big pardon. 
You gave me the enemy's low blow. Hey, that, that's a low blow. And I suppose you were good for something. Yeah, see? see? Yeah, now you, but your you're on to something. Sad. Don't erase. What are you doing? Move! What a save, Shulk. Oh, that was a close one. Are you okay? This is what I wanted to protect you from. Now you see, this is the true nature of the consoles. <gasps> oh, he's gonna wreck him. Who are you? This wasn't the compact. Compact? The one with Zed. We vowed a ceasefire. Not to interfere until matters were resolved. Hmm. Ah, yes. Ceasefire I with Lord Zed? Zed did order us not to get involved or some such. But that was before. Before two of my comrades were slain without remorse. Now things are personal. Oh. those other guys all about never seen him before we can talk about it later we're joining the fray <laughs> thought you'd never ask ha! oh we're fighting with shulk let's go chain attack differences yes chain attacks are back you can now also use chain attacks in future redeemed. When the chain attack gauge is full, press plus to initiate it. Chain attacks in future redeemed differ from the main game in four ways. Unity orders replace Ouroboros orders. Okay, I'm trying to remember what that is, but okay. Accessories can change completion bonuses. Okay, accessories can set heroic chain effects. If none are equipped, these will trigger based on roll. Each unity combo will raise the initial damage ratio. Okay. If you can complete chain orders from both of the characters forming a unity pairing in one chain attack, a unity order will be displayed. Selecting a unity order will end the chain attack, but it will let the pairing perform their special in return. So it's kind of like, okay, kind of like the whole Ouroboros um, pairing thing, but in this case it's yeah, unity orders. So that'll end it. So, okay. Dude, I want to. I want to play as Shulk. Let's go. Come on, let's get our chain attack going. Wow, oh, we're so close. Oh no, A is out. That means we can't do a chain attack with her. Can we even do this without being able to chain attack with her? I don't think so. Like, I can't get her up. Oh, we're all dead. <laughs> yeah, you should have. Step it up, brother. And that's it. That's all she wrote. Yeah, I want to retry that battle. Let's try this again. <sighs> try raising your level or spending affinity points. You can also take a look at the arts, gems, and accessories. Dude, I've like maxed on everything. No, I'm not going to reduce the difficulty. Let's try this again. Yeah, I'm so dead. There's no way I survived this. I have to be able to get a chain attack in. Oh, hmm. Okay, guys, so I ended up dying and I said no to retrying the battle. And something that I think may help is giving Shulk uh, one of the gems. I gave him the ultimate counter, so it deals 100% of attack damage. Hers, I think I changed from Life Bearer, increasing healing, to boosting the speed of Alley Revival. His, I also gave him a double strike instead of whatever he had before. I think he was increasing attack. Um, I just think it would be better to try and get more auto attacks going in. So that way, if that... I don't know if the double strike will um, give him his arts faster or not, but I guess we'll find out. Now let's make the evasion higher. Okay, so no items, and it won't let me. It won't let me put anything here. So, um, 
Yeah, I think that's all we can do. Let's check his affinity growth. Oh, see, I can spend some on him. Let's see what we want to do. That one makes the most sense, let's be honest. We're not going to be starting the battle hitting him in the back, so... Nice. That'll be good. That'll be... That might even be game-changing, guys. As long as I'm not, like, weak, I don't need to worry about being in the regeneration stuff. But yeah, he did get toppled. That's nice. And launched. Hey, that's a first. I feel like we could never get that before. There's another break. There we go. Let's do it. Let's do it before he kills us. Here we go. Alright, now we got it, guys. We can get a chain attack in and hopefully do some major damage. So, uh, it, what it was describing was about how um, unity orders were kind of the, like the uh, Ouroboros thing. So, if I can do A and then I can end it with uh, Matthew, that would work out really well. Yes, we did get the break. That's good, except I don't think we're going to make it over, guys. <gasps> no. Oh, 90%. We didn't get over. Okay. It's unfortunate we didn't get our uh, unity order. Oh, dang. Next time, I'll probably have to just do those two right away. Make sure we, and to ensure we get the unity order. That is if I don't end up winning this fight. Finish him. Yes. Oh, yeah. We, ba we basically got it. Oh. My gosh, that was hard. Who are you guys? Sorry, man. Stealing your show. I'm Matthew, and this is Ed. <laughs> oh, and he's Nicole. We had a run-in with your friend, Glimmer, over there. Why isn't she helping us out? Us Dang it, there you could know? have been five of us. Wait. So then you're... So she just nods. Power. Yes, yes, I am. Now I see. So that's how you were able to kill a Mobius, is it? You ain't seen nothing yet, bub. How about I give you a demo from up close? That's an awfully mean grimace you're giving me there. I did something to you. I'm the faintest idea why you'd be so mad at little old me. Well, maybe you don't, <laughs> but I sure as hell do. I hate you so much. A thousand deaths wouldn't bring me peace. Oh, Matthew, easy now. Yeah, that's that's. Uh, <laughs> yeah, that's We've pretty intense. That there. Thing is, anyone who acts all high and mighty like that needs a bruising. Wow, big words. I'd love to see you try, and I've got just a ticket to make it real interesting. You sound now? like a couple of elementary school kids fighting on the playground. I'd like to see you try. Uh oh. It's another that can't one. be good. Leave it to Uncle Rex. Wait, he's his uncle? No, I'm just kidding. There's no shot. I'll show him a thing or three. 
Hey, isn't that one of his lines from Xenoblade 2? That's awesome. And we save our current progress. That's the end of chapter two, guys. Wow, what a cool ending for him to step in and uh, after Nickel was willing to risk his life. Man, that's so cool. All right, let's go ahead and overwrite okay, this. And it's all backed up. I just want to keep it going and see what happens with Rex here. The city. I recognize this place. Fifteen years ago feels like a dream now. Like it was an eternity away. You might never have to use those again. Now, wouldn't that be amazing? The Queen of Keves, though, she's still not free. What, you think our fight's still not over? Can't things stay like this? The soldiers, they're still fighting. Right at this moment. Personally, if things could just stay this way, I'd be happy. You serious? If Grandad could hear you, he'd lay you out flat. <laughs> yeah, I know what he'd say. The soldiers are the roots from which we grew. But still, we are who we are, right? And them and the Mobius, they're a whole different story. No reason we can't coexist. Nah, don't give me that. Come on. There's no need to fight if we just stay out of each other's way. It's worked out fine for the past 15 years. I guess for you, it's all or nothing, huh? Huh? Those children are everything to me, you know? What choice have I got? Leave it to Uncle Rex. I'll show my finger free. <sighs> you okay? Yeah. yeah. Can you stand? <sighs> Dude, do we get to fight with both of them now? Fighting both Feronises, maybe? Nicole, ready to fight? <sighs> We're just gonna watch a cutscene battle what? take place. There'll be time for thinking later. For now, it's down to brass tacks. <laughs> yeah. Oh, we got Mobius W. All right, guys, let's do this. Shulk is moving around so much. I'm trying to stay inside his defensive circle. I can't. Oh, I think we're supposed to focus these guys. Okay, let's do the Kevesi Ferranis first. Oh, gosh. Oh, good. We can do our chain attack now. Oh, I should have done it on one of the other. Oh, no, we are. We're on the Agni and Feronis now. That's good. That's good. Okay, we want to start with her, I think. Let's try that. We got two. That's good. That's awesome. Okay, now the question is... Do I want to do his? Let's see what the others do. Heals all allies for 30% and lets them regenerate. Increases damage ratio by 100. And his is reduces enemy physical defense during chain attack. Yeah, yeah, I do like that. Okay. I'm, I'm getting, uh, I'm just getting warmed up, guys. Trying to get back into this. Oh, nice. Oh. Uh, we're not going to break 100. That's unfortunate. Okay. 
avalanche onslaught. Oh no! We were 11 short. Ah, still no unity orders, guys. I'm, I'm missing something. I'm missing getting the right order of selecting characters down. That doesn't look good. Oh my gosh, she just revived the other thing. Yes, now we just gotta take out Mobius W and we'll have a chain attack for that one. So I'll try again with the unity order and hopefully I can get it right for you guys. He's doing a ton of damage though. Oh no. Oh shoot. He's just gonna keep doing this over and over until we all die. Oh man. We're gonna have to do that whole fight all over again. Guys, we were so close. Okay, you know what that means. All we need to do is give him a gem. <laughs> oh, man. We're all healed up now, so that's great. And then we'll end it with Matthew on his break. Dude, that did a ton of damage, actually. Huge. This might actually finish him off. Yeah, it did. Overkill. Oh, we're gonna get a ton of ton of points for this. Experience bonus. You take out the Mobius. All in sync. What? In sync. Let's go. Hey! The hell? <laughs> Good. Nice timing there, Rex. Thanks for that. Everyone knows the real hero steps up in the third act. <laughs> Still, something's off here. Hmm. Double the flame clock. But no soldiers inside. There has to be more to it, boss. I've heard a rumor about how one of the Mobius likes to create all kinds of experimental flame clocks. Blinker. Mind looking into that for me? Linka. I can do that. Mm. I'll dispatch a platoon. We'll see if they can get a handle on it. Lovely. It's interesting how most a lot of people have those uh, Aegis gems like she has right. on her chest too, so, the blue one. Who's this then? City refugee, it seems. Well, that explains the Ouroboros power. Hmm. <laughs> and this soldier. Who released him? <sighs> oh, it's My the same kind of shard better. thing that they had in their chest. I don't like that. What does it Tell mean? You. How'd Mobius get the jump on you? Because of her. Uh, Offended breath. We meant to protect her, but she went and gave away our Don't position. you know snitches get stitches? Oh. Hang on. Yeah, he's having flash, but he's like, dude, you look like Pyra. You wanted to get back to your friends, huh? 
<sighs> Even if it meant getting us all killed. Uh, no! Don't try to play the innocent with me. <sighs> you were well aware of the consequences. But you decided to ignore that inconvenient fact. Enough. Stop! Hmm? I am not letting the enemy get into my head! Manners! I didn't ask for any of this! It was almost time for my homecoming! My comrades and I... We made it all this way! I fought! So snuffing hard! <laughs> Listen. Two things. First of all, that there was your enemy. And second, let it go. Your friends are gone. Ouch. Uh. Um. Uh, I'll be your friend, uh, Glimmer. So, what's the plan from here then? It's pretty clear you're not our enemies from the way stuff's panning out, but it's all a bit eh, right? <laughs> Don't give me that. Obviously, we're teaming up. Hey, mate? Dylan! Hey, Dylan, mate, buddy. You were alive! <laughs> that was about my reaction, too. Glad <laughs> you're still with us, Matt. I'll set us up some tents. We can all debrief each other there. Ah, now we're talking. I haven't slept under shelter for yonks. First light, we'll make a start for our base. If it's all right with you, I'd feel a lot safer if we traveled together. I don't really mind. What do you think? <clears throat> all right, then. Great to hear. <laughs> so, what's this base thing? And who are you guys? Feeling kind of lost here. I'll tell you all about it on the way. It's not like we're in any rush. Right. Yeah, I suppose that's true. Fine then. Great. <laughs> oh, hey. So, about these liberators. What do you guys even do? The Liberators are a resistance faction that Rex and I founded to fight back against Mobius. So you've been fighting them too? Yeah. Guess we're Our just gonna follow to these the guys. To return it to how it's supposed to be. But right now, we have another immediate objective. What's that then? There are many people. Ones from the city, like you and Dylan. All soldiers freed from the clots. We rescue them. Keep them from harm. Working towards that is currently the Liberator's primary concern. <laughs> At its founding, we only had a scant few members in addition to Rex and myself. But in time, the people we helped offered us their help in return. And our numbers have swelled considerably. Hmm. I thought Rex and Shulk were in completely different timelines when I played those games. So, that's interesting. <laughs> You're like twitching there, oh, chick. Careful. We'll soon enough. There's our temporary camp now. Well, we made it. We should be safe here for the time being. You can use that tent over there. We've had it set up especially for you. You think they have any combs in there? Because it looks like you could use one there, Shulk. Thank you. <laughs> got, a, you got a strand uh, sticking straight up there. Be a nice change to finally get to Kip under a roof. <sighs> <laughs> Look, everyone here knows what's what. <laughs> Nobody's going to bully you or anything. Gee, thanks. Very reassuring. Not. All right, break it up now. How about we grab a bite and unwind, eh? Don't need you running around hangry. Yeah, especially you, Glimmer. I'm not really hungry. 
Lies. <laughs> Try to get some rest. We'll take the guard shifts. We'll be departing for base in the morning. Don't go the whole night without sleep. Noted. All right then. We'll see you later. That was harsh, boss. Hmm? You didn't have to talk to her like that. Not cool. Tell me something I don't know. <sighs> you don't want her with us, is that it? I'm sure she'd see sense if you just gave her a chance. What's the problem? That's not it, I have a feeling. Is it because it feels too close to home? Yes. You always have to be right on the map. <laughs> exactly. Well <laughs> yeah, yeah. I knew it the moment I saw her. She looks like them. Exactly. Pyra and Mithra, right? right? Someday I knew it'd happen, but not exactly the best timing, is it? It's the same deal with him, you know. What, Shulk? Really? Really, really. Panacea said she had a hunch. Strike me. Hmm. <sighs> I'm confused about that one, but... I guess we're bound by fate. Maybe when I, I go back and edit this, it'll make more sense. Nice gear you've got. <gasps> the joints move without a hitch. And listen to the power of that motor. It's just a tool for destruction. Death. <laughs> Nothing to be praised. Good point. Oh... Uh, Whoa, that's an Equity's pulse driver assembly. No wonder it's so pleasing to the ear and melded with a cylinder. Perfect soldering technique. <laughs> hey, stop that. <laughs> Did you make it yourself? Uh, yeah. Stop appreciating well, my contraptions. I've liked tinkering with machines as well. I can't help myself. Stop giving me praise. I'm not used oh, yeah. to it. You tried to help us, right? Using this. Oh. A tool is merely a tool. It how it's used. used. Yeah, see how it's used Wouldn't is what matters. Agree? Yes, I agree. Be it to kill others or to help them. It's good philosophy. You're on. A war wound from way back when. Then Riku here made me this one. Riku! But, but, what, please? Manner of expression seem pointed. I'm not saying it's bad. It's not bad at all. Just a little squeaky. It's Riku! That same as saying bad. Riku had to make from hodgepodge material. Do not nitpick. <laughs> <laughs> hey, um, would you mind if I take a look? Thought so. Here. You're missing a shim between these bits. That'll be why it creaks. Hang on, I should have one here somewhere. Look at him. Dude, that's what, like, reminds me of the whole seventh blade, or whatever the, the name of the blade is called that Noah used. Like, he said he got it from Master Pond or something that makes me think it came from Shulk. I wonder if that's how it all kind of ties together. What? I won't run away again. Not as if there's anywhere left to run. I, uh... I think it was good. What happened? Huh? Fighting against you. I don't understand. If we hadn't fought, we wouldn't be here now, like this. Here isn't exactly a sparking picnic. People would bully me. What? Because I can't summon a blade. It makes me kind of useless. Hmm. But all those bullies, they're dead now. <laughs> yeah? Well, good for you. But that's <laughs> the way I'm getting Weird flex, but okay. How'd I survive? 
Nobody else did. Uh, hmm. But now, I can make something of myself. That's how it feels. Honestly, just knowing who I'm meant to be fighting, that's the biggest thing of all. Nicole. Another thing I'm happy about. Hmm? Back then, I'm glad I didn't have to kill you. <laughs> you have got to be joking. A little squirt like you can never take me down. We'll see about that. We'll have some, we'll have some training sessions day, later. We became friends. Uh, <laughs> She's like, I don't know if I'd say friends per idiot. se. <laughs> You're an idiot. Dude, she sounds just like Pyra. I love it. She's Py Pyra reincarnate, right? It's gotta be. Oi, oi. Lovely morning today. Perfect weather. Wrong. This cloud cover practically guarantees rain. Morning, everyone. Hello? Whoa. Did I just hear a hello from you? What next? A rain of brogs. <laughs> Plain rain's bad enough. <laughs> Damn, if I didn't know better, I'd think you were warming up to me. I was forgetting the real idiot among us. <laughs> there you go. It's cool. This is progress. <laughs> she and A are going to get along nicely because uh, they both feel like Matthew's an idiot. <laughs> Morning all. Feeling refreshed and ready to take on the world? Yeah, thanks to you guys. Haven't slept this well in ages. Don't mention it. I yeah, don't It'll mention the ages. Base, ages. Yeah, speaking of, where is this base of yours exactly? Once we climb that cliff and follow the road, you'll That's be able to see yourself. Ha, oh, sweet. Can't wait to see what it's like. How about you, Glimmer? Yeah, sure, Not whatever. Interested. <laughs> Not interested, yeah, is he? Uh, <laughs> still being a sulk, eh? I'm a little curious, I think. Yeah, at a boy, Nicole. See that, Glimmer? You could stand to learn from this one. <laughs> Can someone shut this guy up? <laughs> He'll grow on you. We have some refugees from the city, by the way, back at base. You should let them know you're fine once we've arrived. I'm sure they'll appreciate it. Yeah, I'll be sure to do that. Thanks. All right, we all done with the banter. This road's not going to walk itself. Yeah, let's make tracks. Unity setup. You can now customize your Unity pairings. <gasps> That'll be cool. Changing the different pairings to do so. Go to the main menu, Unity, and press Y. Whoa. Okay, so yeah, try different pairings that best suit your battle needs. That will be sick. I will definitely have to give that some uh, community expanded link. Uh, okay, I'll definitely have to give that a test. <laughs> Dylan. Oh, hey. All oh, right, right, right. Because we've met some new friends or old friends in the case of Dylan. All right, guys. We are here at Panorama Camp. Oh my gosh, all of these notifications, they just keep coming. Can I move? Can I do anything now? Open the main menu with X. It's gonna set up a Unity pairings. Yep, it's gonna force me to do this so I can learn how to do it. That's probably a good thing. But it's been such a long episode. I'm ready to call it. Why? Okay, set up Unity pairings. For the first Unity pairing, try pairing up Matthew and Nicole. Okay, so there's Nicole. I'm on Matthew currently, so. Follow your lead then. Second pair, try pairing up A and Rex. So I'm on A. Let's find Rex. To him. Right hey. Wherever the hand is pointing, that makes sense. Okay, and then of course, Shulk and Glimmer. I'll be sure to match your rhythm. You can now confirm the three chosen Unity pairings once you've looked them over. Select confirm. Nice. Okay, yeah, sure. We'll confirm this. Why not? Unity combos and skills differ based on the pairings. Be sure to experiment with all sorts of setups. Oh, I will experiment. That's exactly what I was saying earlier. I'm, I'm gonna take some time to experiment with that, aren't I? Yes, that's right. Yes, I am. Unity indicators. Oh, that's right. I did see those and I was wondering what those meant. 
Recharge for other characters' specials is shown by the circles left and above the character's gauge, the active character's gauge. Oh, that's convenient. So I can just do ZL and then X, Y, or B to call their uh, specials. Okay. All right, guys. Well, finally, I can kind of stop and take a break. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for sticking around. I hope you guys have really enjoyed this episode like I have. That was a lot of really good cutscenes and a lot of information to take in. So if you did enjoy this episode, don't forget to strike that like and subscribe to the channel. And we'll catch you guys on the next episode. See ya, nerds.